For this problem, we are asked to find a polynomial function of lowest degree with integer coefficients that has the given zeros. And my zeros are 1 third, negative 1 seventh, i, and negative i. So I know that if a value is a zero, then I have the following factors. In other words, if c is a zero, then x minus c is a factor. So now I have four factors that I generated from the four zeros given. But my problem asked for integer coefficients, I need to get rid of these fractions. So I can rewrite those factors as 3x minus 1 and 7x plus 1. I get the same 0 here. I get the 1 third as a 0 if I set that equal to 0 and solve for x. And here I get negative 1 seventh if I set that equal to to zero and solve for x. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna multiply those factors together. So here are my four factors that I'm gonna multiply together. So um, I'm gonna multiply these two together and these two together. And I end up with, if I FOIL these two, I get 21x squared minus 4x minus 1, and the other two become x squared minus i squared, but we know that i squared equals negative 1, so I can rewrite that factor as x squared plus 1. So now what I need to do is multiply this binomial times that trinomial, and I'll just use my distributive property here, and I'll multiply that x squared through, and I get 21x to the fourth minus 4x cubed minus x squared, and then I'm gonna multiply the one through in the same fashion using distributive property, and I end up with and I'm gonna go ahead and line them up this way to make it easy on myself. So now I combine like terms and I end up with 21x to the fourth minus 4x cubed plus 20x squared minus 4x minus one. Notice, integer coefficients. We took care of that in the beginning by getting rid of the 1 third and 1 seventh. So that is your answer.